Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how you can add value to your trainers when you're selling on eBay. You can get extra price by just doing this practice, which basically means you need to clean them. And I'll show you in this video how you clean them. So we have here a pair of Air Max 97, quite good condition, the rims are fantastic, um, the sole Looks good, everything's good, all good. So, what we need to do is just slightly clean this pair. You don't have to, but all of my, when, I sell, when I'm selling on eBay, I like to clean them up and get an extra, extra price for these pairs. Okay, so uh, we have another pair of. Air Force One in brilliant condition, brilliant, absolutely fantastic condition. All we need to do is slightly clean the bottom. Here, the, here. the rims are perfect. Well, few um, dirt mark around here. So, and we have another pair of Air Max 270. Now this pair, seen his days, give a faded sole here. So it needs a quite work done onto this pair. Again, as you can see, a lot of dirt and grime and yeah, the rims needs to be work on. So now, so we have the shoes, the trainers. Now we're gonna show you what we do, how we clean it. We use a a pillowcase, All right? So you can use whenever you use pillowcase, All right? And all you need to do is put it in a washing machine. We have the washing machine here, and these are the the ingredients we like to use or the formula we're gonna make we'll use some washing up powder and we'll use baking soda and a bit of washing up liquid we'll mix them up we'll mix the formula up and then we'll show you the procedures also need a little you can use a uh, use two Toothbrush, and uh, we have some other brushes we'll show you. So we have the brushes here, we have one brush, we have literally another brush, we have the toothpaste, sorry, tooth, toothbrush, not toothpaste. And we'll show you how we clean the trainers. Right, so we're going to pour in some baking soda here. Same amount will do. The next ingredients we pour in some soap powder, washing of soap. It's for Washing your clothes, okay. You put some of that in it. Put some washing up liquid. And there we go. Now we will put some water, slightly water up, just a bit, slight amount of water. As you can see, we put some. Water now. What we need to do is mix it up. So we will use. Let's use a spoon, or literally we can use a fork just to mix it up. So let's use a fork. Okay, mix it up. We need to put a bit more because we put too much water there. So let's put some more soda. Mix 
going in. Your solu the solution is sticking now, so what you need to do now. Okay, so dip your toothbrush in and basically work on the rims now, like that. Okay, work on it like this. Yeah, work on it. Get it in like that. Once we finish, you'll see how clean. I'll show you this pair. Amazingly clean. You will not believe it. How nice they look. So basically, got all the spread around everywhere. Like that. Do this. And then this bit. There we go. The other pair, do the same with the other pair. In fact, firstly, you do all of your yeah, do the same. Now, uh, as you can see, this bit has got a bit of stain here. Dark marker, so we're just going to work on that. As you can see, it's already came off. There we go. So basically work on it. Spread it underneath as well. Now we then use the this pair. So this pair means you not as small for now. So yeah. We're going to put it round the rim. First of all. Yeah, work on it as you can see this contains a lot of dirt here around here as you can see a lot of dirt and I could really work on this pair so the best thing to do is brush the solution and leave it for a couple of minutes and then you have to start working on with a, the other brushes I'll show you in a minute. So do the other pair. Again. Do it. I'm just doing it quickly because this video is going to be lengthy so I don't want to take all of your time. Over like this, I want to grab the other pair now. This, this pair, let's grab the ninety Nike MMS ninety seven. Let's get a 97 and we are ready to 
to me. Because relatively this is this pair looks good. So don't need to work too much on this pair. Okay. The other pair please. Thank you. Let's do this. Again, we got the second pair here. We have the the proper brushing going on now, so we're gonna grab the solution. I'm gonna add a bit more uh, washing up liquid. All right, let's we do have a lot of washing up liquid by the way so no need to worry so right, here we go we got the solution and I'm going to work it like this as you can see this will work on it and this will be like a magic The second brush, and we do this version like this. As you can see, look, look at the difference already. So this is the uh, the hardest one. A lot of dirt in the soil and then rim so we're going to work on this one quite hard so we are going to first of all we have to really, 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 really go hard on it and the rims as you can see look look at the difference already in the rims we have to work really really hard on it We're gonna do the ninety seven now. You can see what we need to do. Right, we are going to the Nike 97 now. Get yeah, the rings. Go a bit tough on them, like this. Go all over it. Give your solution. And go all over the cleaner like this. The soil, if it's heavy soil, you need to wash first and then you start washing it in. So we, right, we're on. So we've done all our scrubbing and brushing. Now that is the difference between 19 selling it at £19.99 and £29.99. Just a couple of minutes of hard work, a bit of grind, and, and that uh, improves your selling. Right, so now we've done all our scrubbing and brushing. As you can see, they already look pretty good. Now what we're going to do, we are going to insert it into our washing machine. We're going to stick it inside the washing machine to get washed. Now, this is the difference between selling a pair of trainers at £19.99 
or $29.99 just spending a few minutes just doing this technique getting them cleaned and as you can see your trainer will sell like hot cake so grab your pillowcase put them in there put the, now before you do that let's put some powder in there first I'm sticking some powder in okay I'm gonna put some liquid in as well some liquid in there put some liquid Okay, put them in there. Oh, this one, so that matter. We are going to put some just slightly bit of um, baking soda in there as well. Put some baking soda. Alright, and put all our trainers in there. Make sure we all got we have the trainers. Yep, we have the trainers in there. And luckily my pillowcase contains some buttons so we're going to button them the next thing is to put in a washer dishwasher sorry not dishwasher we put it into the wash Done all our work. We've put it in a pillowcase, and we will put it inside the washing machine now. Stick it in the washing machine. Okay, and we'll turn it on and leave it for about an hour or so. Wash. So let's find and and that will do about forty-seven minutes. Yeah. That will do, and we'll start the machine. And there we go, all done. And we'll show you the results when it's finished. Right, everyone, now uh, as you can see, we just finished our washing the trainers inside our washing machine. Now we're going to take them out and we'll have a look how they have performed. Now, after taking them out, what you have to do, because it's winter here in the UK now, there's no way you can put outside and let them get dried. You have to obviously use heater, put on the top of your radiator or some other means of heating facility you have to dry them. If it feels like you're doing it on the summertime, you can obviously put it outside and Hopefully that should dry good by sun, but there's no way now. We're in the month of January, mid-January 2021 in the UK. This is winter time here. And there's no way you can dry them outside, so you have to dry them indoors. So obviously use the heater. Here we are. This is the pair of Air Force One, as you can see. Look at that. How pretty and beautiful it is now. All I need is a pair to get dry. As you can see, look at that. Absolutely brilliant. Now, you can sell a pair like this for 35 to 40 quid easily on eBay. Easy peasy. There we are. Now, let's get the, let me get the uh, Nike. This pair out the 270. There we are. As you can see, look at it, how beautiful it looks. Absolutely breathtaking. Look at it. Look at it. Look at how clean and fresh it looks. 
as you can see there we are look at it look at the rims incredible stunning you see how bright clean so well what you can what I managed to do add value to these pairs okay let's get the, the second pair out this one out now and hopefully get the last pair I'll take a look at this as you can see ladies and gentlemen absolutely breathtaking look at that look how clean and fresh and beautiful it is now tell me please you can easily now ask for 10 15 pound extra on these pairs and you'll get it just spending a few minutes clean them up and using your washing machine to just wash them so make sure you have a nice pillow that you can use one with hope probably one with a button on that'll be nice so if not just make sure you tie it up properly so that way you don't lose it there we are let's drop this here and let's show you one by one there we go ladies and gentlemen as you can see look at that absolutely breathtaking yeah, look at that bottom sole so what I need to do is get them dried up um, I'll use um, radiators to get them dry or just hang them somewhere warm so let's try it so once again thank you so much for watching this video and all of my other video please make sure you go and smash the like button and subscribe to the channel